Hello Cancers and welcome back to my channel Luma Moon Tarot. So Cancers, I am here to do your daily reading. This reading is for the collective so it may or may not resonate with you. Okay, just take what does resonate, toss out the rest. You guys know the drill, right? Your pros. Um, just don't try to force it, right? And thank you Cancers so much for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations, all the love that you guys give me every day. Thank you so much. I love you. I love this soul tribe, I gotta say. You're my family, Cancer. I've adopted you. You just haven't received the memo yet. <laughs> right? All right, so um, I kind of wanted to check into the week, the energy of the week, right? It's, it's Monday morning. Let's um, check into the weekly energy here that we've got for the next five days, right? Divine, what do you have for Cancer? Ooh, yep, the end of a cycle here. Oh boy, Cancer. Somebody's coming towards you, Cancer. Um, you could possibly be dealing with a Virgo, um, an Aries, a Pisces, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I feel like this person may be in a commitment with this Queen of Pentacles up here. This is, it could be um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or Gemini. Um, that's coming to an end here. It's the end of a cycle for that commitment. And I feel like whoever they're leaving behind, um, they know that they're coming towards you. Who, the, I'm, you know, this is who your person is with. I feel, and they, they intuitively know that this masculine wants to come towards you. They may have even already told this Queen of Pentacles that I'm seeing you as the world card. And, you know, they, this person wants to apologize. They want to make you some kind of offer. Can we restart this? It's been a long time coming, Cancer. This apology and this offer, and this is the slowest moving night in the deck, Okay. But yeah, this person's taking a leap of faith here towards you, I feel, Cancer. Um, I feel like they're breaking away from this Queen of Pentacles. It's the end, the end, all right? It's time for this person to write a new story here. And honestly, that yeah, they're coming for their Six of Cups here. Oh my gosh, Cancer, they want to commit to you here. They do. We've got the Ten of Pentacles. I'm telling you, this person from your past, they're coming forward. It's you that they want, Cancer. It is you that they want. Um, and, and look at you. You're rocking your own world here. You're very independent. Um, you know, yeah, you've got nine pentacles here already, Cancer. Okay, the most you can have in the deck is ten. At the tenth pentacle, you finally have the love that's going to grow into something committed, okay, something solid, something that'll stand the test of time, all right? Without that 10th pentacle, you're okay on your own. I feel like you're happy, you're very busy, you're working a lot, and whatever it is you're working on and nurturing, it's growing, um, very abundant, okay? So I feel like your future is secure here. Um, but there's a per this person from your past, they're coming in to give you that 10th pentacle. They want to commit. This person wants to commit. Um, I'm not really liking the fool energy that much. I feel like this person may have done some foolish things in the past or they're... Um, they do impulsive, risky things. I feel like they are kind of taking a big risk in coming towards you here. They're feeling very um, intimidated by you, I want to say. And they're a little bit nervous about this apology because they know that they have a lot to apologize for and a very small cup with the fish in the cup, okay? Um, and they know, I feel, that you deserve to be treated better than the way they treated you in the past, all right. Um, yeah, I feel like you could have been the other woman uh, or other person. Take It's not gender specific, right, guys? But I feel like that's how you were considered. It. You, you're like, um, you're gorgeous, okay? Uh, this person is very, what's the word I'm looking for? Tempted. You're a huge temptation for this person. 
But I feel like you're having this new beginning for yourself here. You're not playing any more games. You're not wasting any more time. You're moving forward with your life. And this person is in a lot of regret. They don't want to lose you, Cancer. Could be dealing with a Virgo. I'm probably the only reader out here who sees that as a Virgo card because it's the hermit without the hoodie. Okay? Yeah, keeping you trapped and stuck. Oh, I feel like this is this karmic up here. Oh, well, Queen of Pentacles. I don't really want to call him a karmic. Um, but yeah, this is somebody who just knows that this person's going to walk away and go to you. They're, they're trapped in their mind. They're completely upset about it. They, they're sad. Look at that look on their face, you know. Oh, look at how their hand drops off of this pentacle. This is somebody who may end up getting money out of this split, okay? Especially if there's a divorce case or alimony or child support property, something like that. Um, but they're sad because they know this masculine is walking away to go to you, okay? They're watching this situation. Um, they're starting to get kind of revengeful. Vengeful? Is that how? Vengeful, right? And they're stalking. They're starting to get this um, immature behavior, okay? Um, they're, this is really driving them crazy. It really is. And they may even be threatening to say something about this masculine. That could have been why. Yeah, I feel like they're being paid off here, to be honest. Yeah, just so this can come to an end. I feel like because this masculine is protecting themselves with this sword. I feel like they know a truth and so does this karmic. And I feel like the karmic's going to end up with some money because they're threatening maybe to say something about this. And I feel like um, this king of swords just feels very protective to me. They're either protecting you, Cancer, or they're protecting themselves. Because I feel like, the, yeah, I feel like this is something that could really ruin this person. Whatever this karmic has to say. All right, what else can you show me? Yeah, I feel like there's something that they're threatening to say. It's, it's immature energy, okay? Yeah, it, this is something that could put this person in jail. It's something that, and I, I kind of picked up on that when I moved the cards around the first time. This is something that could get him fined or put him in jail. What is this, Cancer? All right, so show us more. What is this person worried about? What, what is the karmic going to say? I'm telling you, they're going to reveal something here. I'm telling you, a lot of talking, a lot of information to reveal something. Okay, something's coming to the light here. They're, they're going to tell some kind of secret. And it could put this person in jail. It could put this masculine in jail. They're definitely having a health issue because of the stress. They're really worried. I'm t I, I just feel they're them protecting themselves here with the sword. Like the karmic is like, I'm going to tell blah, 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 blah. And the masculine is over here going, no, you better not. That will ruin me. Yeah, it's something that could send this person to jail. Maybe they received some funds like, I don't know, the wrong way or something. They're in a lot of regret for something here and worried, 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 worried. This karmic knows something that could get this masculine in a lot. Of, it's a secret. I'm telling you, secrets. Secrets. And I feel like um, high priestess energy, um, you're out of it, Cancer. You don't, have, you don't have anything to do with it, really. This could, be, this could have something to do with work. Oh, 
work and a marriage i feel like this karmic is getting revenge you know they could have some kind of business together a partnership right yeah there's something going on with some information about this person's work or how they make money for some of these karmics they kind of threaten this person and try to get them to actually commit to them in a marriage some of these people aren't married yet but they they want to be and if that happens the uh, the masculines are going to be like heavily burdened because they actually are in love with you this person's going to be yeah i feel like the karmics are going to try to talk this person into getting married or something or maybe there's already an engagement here what in the heck they've got something over your person's head okay and i can't figure out what it is what do they have over this masculine's head it may be different for all of you but i feel like it's kind of like extortion or something i don't know and maybe that's why it's taken your person so long to take action on this they want this with you they do but there's something that's holding them down to this karmic here with that bracket and i feel like it's a secret that's about to come out seriously this this page this page of swords is going to talk man this person may even have an std they may have an std here and if that news comes out oh my gosh it's going to be heartbreaking for your person for that's not for all of you that's only for some of you what else what else is going to come out here so an std immature behavior something like that there's going to be some gossip i'm telling you it's gonna it's really gonna break this person oh boy i feel like they're remaining stuck because they can see this is going to happen they know this is going to happen if they get themselves unstuck because they're dealing with this this queen of swords here i feel like this person is they're afraid of the truth they're afraid the truth is going to come out i'm telling you something there could even be um some kind of documents on it or something like that i don't know man and this card keeps coming out i feel like there's some kind of proof this person could this could even be like a warrant okay for their arrest for real this could be a warrant for their arrest for some of them not for all of you but for and look and here comes the police <gasps> and the justice system ooh and this could cost them a huge fine it would go public and this person wants a new beginning with you yeah i feel like there's there's something some kind of secret that could actually end up with this person's arrest jail that's not going to be for all of you okay this is not for all of you i will tell you it just seems like it's very um um it's going to be it's it's going to be for a small amount of you i feel i don't know honestly what is the secret yeah i'm seeing this is the police i'm seeing this is um the judge the jury a courtroom okay i'm seeing this contract here is like a warrant they come and get this person from work they get this person from work read them their rights they go to jail sabotage i'm telling you this karmic wants to sabotage this masculine they do not want them having a new beginning with you they do not want that okay so yeah they're holding something over your person's head but they're about to spill it and your person's gonna get in some legal trouble here oh boy 
Yeah, I feel like they know this is about to happen too. They're really, really burdened by this. Um, they feel like hiding, to be honest with you. I kind of feel like a sense of hiding. I'm also seeing the them in, you know, behind the bars here. They, they know that this is coming. Oh my gosh, yeah, look, they, they can feel it. They know this is coming. I had the Seven of Swords on the bottom of the deck. I feel like they thought they would get away with something and they're not going to. They're wondering if they can get away with it. I don't think that's going to happen. If this karmic says what whatever they have to say to the authorities, this person's going down. I don't know what they got into yet, so I'm trying, though, guys. All right. Um, it's a judge, yeah. Oh, my gosh. They are stressed out. They are freaking stressed out, you guys. What is this? Clarify this two of pentacles. They don't know what's going to happen here. Yeah, this they're under judgment. They know they could be under judgment, and I I feel like they did something hidden right behind this curtain. They were smug about it, thought they would get away with it, but they're not going to get away with it here. Um, they don't know how they're going to change this around. They don't know what they're going to do. They don't know what they're going to say to the judge, the jury. They don't know. They don't know how much time they could get. They don't know how big of a fine this will be. They don't know what's going to happen once this information comes out. Guys, they just know they need to find a way to defend themselves. Ooh. They need to find a defense like an attorney. What is this? Sorry, sorry, Cancer. I'm trying to pick it apart, but th this really is what I'm getting here. You're seeing it, right? And they are really stressed out. Yeah, gossip, talk. I feel like this karmic is planning together with a group of feminine energies. This is a freaking plan. And they're spreading around some kind of gossip about this person, maybe how they do their business or something about their job or I know the police come and, and um, they're, you know, you're under arrest. We have a warrant for your arrest. I feel like they show up at this person's work, their place of work. This karmic is just basically doing whatever they can now to lash out because they know your person wants to come to you. And if they get this person wrapped up in a drama, they won't make it to you. And they're getting them wrapped up in, the, in a drama, something. This person could go to jail for whatever this is. It's kind of specific, though, so I know this isn't going to be for all of you, but this is what's going on behind the scenes. And honestly, you don't know anything about it. You're out here living in peace and tranquility, doing your thing, rocking your world, working on your business, doing a lot of working here. You're busy working. I, I feel like your energy is not a part of it. Thank God, right? This is why you were pulled out and protected and kept um, isolated and from harm so that you didn't get involved in something like this. But there is a secret coming out that could put this person in jail. Okay? This particular person, you could be dealing with uh, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Leo. We've got a lot of Virgo out here. Libra. Um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Uh, Sagittarius. Possibly another Cancer. Yeah, Leo. Oh, Taurus. Yeah, this person's going to have to... I just see them having to be strong. They're going to have to be strong through this and stand their ground. Um, I feel like this Emperor scared AF. Seriously. 
they look scared to me I don't know I'm feeling it guys this person's shaking on the inside but they're trying to look um, they're trying to look like they're not okay but yeah look curled up in a little ball I half the time 50% of the time I see this is somebody who's scared right curled up in a little ball protecting themselves I'm telling you oh because they're in toxic whatever they did either they're afraid of this toxic individual or afraid of what this this karmic individual knows about them they know and it's something that's the truth it's the truth they were involved in something toxic something very bad here and it could land this person in jail it could it's really not telling me what it is it could be drugs or a drug addiction um, or just this karmic wanting revenge it could have something to do with what they do for work it could be something sexual all right clarify this devil they're scared man and for me to get this card out after I get done telling you this emperor looks scared, that's, that's definitely a confirmation. This person is freaking out. Like they're shaking, okay? Clarify this devil. What is the secret, please, divine? What is the secret? I don't think, we're, I don't think I'm supposed to know. I don't think you're supposed to know. You, you everybody's been pulled away from the karmic situations right the the divine feminines and light workers have been pulled out of it to keep us safe right i feel like it's got something to do with money whatever it is they're about to lose a lot here everything they've worked for they could lose their savings they could lose time i you know i feel like this person Oh man, they're about to lose a lot here. See, they've got to walk away from all of these pentacles. This could have been um, a commitment here between them and that page of swords that could have been very long term, six to seven years. And I feel like this person, they put a lot of effort into it. And um, just because they want to choose a different path now, it's almost like this, this karmic is going to try to ruin this person's life. All right? That's what I'm getting here, guys. Like, this is freaking serious. All right? What is the secret? I don't think we're supposed to know. Can you tell us the secret, Divine? I'm trying, Cancer. <laughs> It, it could be different for all of you, but, you know. They're scared. This masculine is scared. Look, no more happy family. They're praying. This is going to ruin their life. This is something that could ruin their life. Okay, guys? And they are praying that they can get out of this unscathed i don't even know what else to say wow okay so this i feel is very specific okay it's i don't think it's going to be for all of you but just use your intuition use your discernment okay but this is what i have today cancer um, I am going to take this into the extended, guys. I kind of feel like I have to. I need to keep trying to figure out what that secret is. So we're going to switch decks and take it over to Patreon. There's a link to follow at the bottom of my description box um, if you're interested in watching me try to find the secret. Okay? I don't know if I'm going to find out or not, but we're going to try. And, um, you know, Cancer, it, I, I hope this helps. I hope it resonates with someone. If you like this video, please click the like button, right? Like, subscribe, comment, share. I love the comments, guys. And you know we all, every reader out here, we love a click of a like button and have um, new people join our soul tribe. So subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and if you like this vibe and it resonates, right? 
And um, yeah, we're going to scope this out over on Patreon. Um, until next time, Cancers, take care of you, my darlings, and peace out.